Hello everybody, Jurassic Player here. And today I'm going to be showing you an update of the R4i Gold. Um, despite what this shows you here, this great sticker, it's actually the 3DS version that I'm supposedly have. Um, when I asked for this, they gave me this one, and I guess it's before they actually changed the sticker. <laughs> So yeah, if you if you use the wrong update, it will say um, upgrade not needed um, when you update. Um, if it says that, just swap to the other one and then try that. Um, now I've already updated this um, in a failed video, and so it's supposed to have Miami Nights. 3D by Ubisoft and so pretty much um, if you've seen my ace card 2i one it's the exact same thing pretty much um, the only real difference is that it takes a little longer to do and it's got this kind of not nice looking screen but it's kind of convenient in a way and the bottom Despite being uh, fully updated, it will still go through it anyway. But instead of boring you with that, um, yeah, it will just go through the update and it will say update succeeded in peculiar English. And um, yeah, apparently it still updates even though it's already updated. And even though there's a text line that supposedly says no update needed, so why they couldn't have added that one on to the regular one, I don't know. But that's how it is, and so that's it. Um, the NDS Light, ver the NDS L version of the update is for unbreaking, or if you want, you can use it to flash your flash card. Why you'd want to do that, I have no idea. Because um, you have to do the extra step where you unplug this and then plug it back in before clicking A. And um, yeah, why, why do that when you can just click A? Unless of course you have a bricked flash card. Um, on the topic of bricked flash cards, um, you can only unbrick your flash card reflash your flash cart by using a DS light and a another uh, see upgrading succeeds but anyways um, you will need another flash cart and another DS light um, DSI or 3DS will not work because they hot swap correctly I guess you could say where um, the actual where then instead of freezing like you usually see on the 3d on the regular ds they'll actually close the uh the uh flash card out and then uh that breaks things so yeah don't try that on a dsi or 3ds because you won't get anywhere um apart from that um this is a kind of pointless video um but anyways uh thanks for watching and um I recommend you watch my uh, Ace Card 2i one if you need if you have more questions about uh, reflashing because this actually is an Ace Card clone originally, and of course it still is an Ace Card clone. They haven't actually changed much, but um, yeah, I'd recommend looking at that. Um, it's kind of helpful um, for various reasons. Um, just ignore the. Uh, the version numbers that really doesn't matter they update the same way so yeah that's it um thanks for watching and uh i hope you'll watch whatever i put out next um eventually i'm actually going to be showing a video of the iSmart mm sooner or later the uh dingux plugin yeah i have a lot to say about that one 
That one's gonna be real long though. But anyways, um, thanks for watching. Uh, see you later.